Real-time tracking of a user's hands and arms is valuable in a wide variety of human-computer interactions, from virtual reality input to context-aware virtual agents. We present Disco Band, a novel self-contained smartwatch strap featuring 16 very small depth cameras. Eight of these sensors image outward from the band, chiefly to capture the user's body and surrounding environment, while another ring of eight sensors are oriented towards the wearer's hand. Each depth sensor captures an 8x8 depth image, which can be rendered as a 3D point cloud. We combine the different sensor views to build a unified point cloud, able to capture descriptive geometry, in this case, hand pose. All combined, our sensor strap transforms the user's wrist into a powerful fisheye depth imager. These rays are reminiscent of a disco ball reflecting light, which is what inspired our system name, Disco Band. This rich data can be used to power a wide variety of applications. For instance, Disco Band can estimate the user's upper body pose in real time. In our user study, our 10 participants had a mean per joint positional error of 5.9 centimeters. Similarly, Disco Band can use its point cloud data to estimate the wearer's hand pose in real time. In our user study, we found a mean per joint positional error of 11.7 millimeters. We also created basic implementations for four other potential use cases. First off, we found that Disco Band is sometimes able to image the other arm, opening up the possibility of bimanual activity tracking, even though one arm is entirely uninstrumented. Second, our eight hand-facing depth sensors are not only well positioned to capture the hand, but also objects that are currently being held in the hand. Third, Disco Band can appropriate everyday services for ad hoc touch input, including the ability to detect clicks, swipes, and even basic shapes. Fourth and finally, taking advantage of Disco Band's 4 meter sensing range, we can capture point clouds of the local environment. For full technical and evaluation details, please see our paper.